All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. I just wanted to show you what I do um, for a late spring frost for some of my plants. I got a couple of Japanese maples here. They're green viridis lace leaf. And so I just take some burlap and layer it over and then just use some zip ties to uh, make sure that they're stitched together enough to where they're not gonna come off. And that usually does it. Um, had to do the same thing last year. Um, might actually do it. I have a couple of uh, blueberry bushes over here. Might actually hit those. Those are newer as well. I'll probably end up, I got a couple more pieces I'll use on those. All right, so I just went ahead and wrapped these real quick. I had some long ones, I just draped it over and then brought it around and wrapped it up and then just gave it uh, one little zip tie at the top and then that just ties everything together. Same thing with this one, so. Yeah, that's really all you need. But yeah, um, definitely something you wanna do if you got a frost coming or if you got snow. Um, we, you know, our, our winter was kinda cut short and so, uh, you know, things just started to bloom, you know, pollen the whole nine yards, so. Um, you know, it was to the point to where I actually almost uh, got the mower out. Neighbors did, but not me. Uh, I wasn't ready yet. Just had other things going on. Like I said, I'm doing a lot of stuff, so I'm busy. But uh, yeah, I just figured um, last night we ended up getting a frost and we actually got snow. So we woke up this morning and there was like snow everywhere and it was on the front half of this green viridis. And this one's pretty big. It's about, um, I'd say a good six foot wide at this point. And we've had it in here for, I don't know, maybe, uh, I wanna say like eight years, eight, nine years, something like that. But um, I don't know if you can see, and maybe it's just me, maybe it's just uh, some of these aren't, you know, cause they're not fully out and extended yet. So, but some of them didn't look like they were the best. They were pretty dark. Like there's some, right? can't see it but right there it's almost like they have a whitish color to them so um, like I said what I did is I just went ahead and took a bunch of burlap and put it over and then used a bunch of zip ties and made sure that it was all secure so tonight we'll end up because uh, they're calling for snow here in probably like half hour and then the temperatures are gonna dip down to probably I would say I think it's going down to 28 and last night it only went below freezing like by a degree or two and it was only for like two hours two and a half hours three hours maybe well it's going to be like seven or eight hours that it's going to be below freezing and it's going to be like four i'd say at least four degrees below freezing so uh, if you guys have plants you need to care for this is the way to do it so just wanted to show you guys that real quick if you guys like the channel and not subscribed hit the subscribe button and the alert bell so you guys are notified of future updates obviously this is for the gardening section of the channel so but uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in the next video. So come on back. Take care. God bless.